Ooh, let's continue. So what's the movie script about Esther in the Mirror? Esther is a young Nigerian woman. Story of my life. Young Nigerian woman adjusting to the university life in the US while planning a twin sister's wedding and even getting engaged only to discover she's doing it all wrong. Who says so? Jesus. So remember, when you see Esther's name, it's actually me. It's a true life story of my life, about myself and Jesus, and how God helped me through life challenges. So the movie script is about Esther, a born-again Christian, faced with having to help her sister plan a wedding while failing business school. Hmm and saying yes to a fast food walking zoom boyfriend who asks her to marry him so esther knows she's made a huge mistake as a reflection in the mirror a transponder to god has gone radio silent so esther must have faith in herself as she confronts a professor a fiance and her family to prove her worth to herself and restore signal to God. Hmm. So this is a unique movie script written by God himself. Yes. Like what makes this movie script different from others? First of all, this story is like no other as it explores Esther's devotion to her faith as a born again Christian in spite of the doubt and disapproval of those around her it is both entertaining and thought-provoking as esther finds herself hmm, in multiple humorous and personally challenging situations which prompt her to re-examine her choices in life as she, as she tries to be closer to god so this is the story of my life but this time around my testimonies are coming to life instead of me saying it i'm showing it in a movie hmm very powerful and i'm using this opportunity to reach out to producers please if you are interested in buying god's scripts and producing god's movie please reach out to me via my website taijima.com also, if you are an actor or actress and you want to feature in God's movie, please reach out to me via my website also, mm -hmm, taijima.com. Another major thing God wants you to know is that God's script has already been sold in the spirit. Hmm. The spiritual comes before the physical. So, it's about to manifest in the physical, in reality. Remember, God sees the future. God knows the exact producer that will buy our scripts. He knows the date our script will be sold. He knows the people in the movie. He knows the date and time we will produce this movie. And boom, the movie is out. The world is ready to watch it, whether in cinema or Netflix or whatever way God wants to inspire the world so this movie is not mine hmm. this movie belongs to god god will fund it himself god will produce it himself i am obedient listening to god you know like i don't know who will produce the movie our movie hmm. i don't know the time but god knows i'm believing in god i know coming here to share this is risky but because god says so i'm obedient to god so whether God produces this movie or not, I obeyed him, wrote the script with him, but I believe he will produce it because God does not lie. Mm -hmm. I will not give up. I will keep reaching out to producers out there because God will lead me to the one he wants for me. Whether they respond or not, God will lead me to the one that will respond. So don't give up on what God has laid on your heart. You have to keep going until God's script is sold, 
got movies produced like i was thinking of keeping this loki you know after it's sold after the movie is out i will tell the world you know but god says tell the world right now mm -hmm. so as i'm sharing it there can be a producer listening to this right now and will be interested in seeing the script and producing god's movie so what i'm doing is being obedient to the voice of god god wants us to be obedient to his voice do what he says ignore those people laughing at you ignore your families laughing at you be obedient and do what he says mm -hmm. so if you say what if this goes wrong what if it doesn't mm -hmm. like be positive think positive believe what god believes about you god says your best is in front of you believe him mm -hmm. like it does not matter your situation right now believe what god believes about you your latter days will be greater than your former days believe god like god is telling me write the book you know i wrote it with the help of the holy spirit god said write this movie script i wrote it with the help of the holy spirit seek help in writing it god brought helpers so my job is to be obedient let people know about god's movie script on social media my website that's what i'm doing right now i'm just being obedient to god i will do my part with god and god will do the rest also remember god has an appointed time for everything remember god says in due season we will reap if we do not faint god is in control so whatever god is telling you to do obey him if he tells you to write a book do it and he will help you write it don't run away <laughs> work with the help of the holy spirit to write it if god says turn your book into a movie tell him how do we start partner with him don't run away god will teach you it's purpose time it's purpose season you know if he says let people know about your movie script on social media website do it you never know maybe there, there is a producer listening to this right now and because you are obedient god will make that producer reach out to you and produce god's movie so obedience is key my family so i'm letting the world know about god's new project i just finished writing with god's help god's movie script esther in the mirror so if you're a producer out there reach out to me let us support god's movie by producing it and making it happen you know don't shy away it's your time it's our time to shine for god's kingdom mm -hmm. i'm all about god's kingdom seek first the kingdom of god and every other thing will be added unto you so let's do it mm -hmm. write god's book write god's movie script produce god's movie and many more god has for us remember god has completed everything he told you in heaven he's waiting on you to believe so it can manifest here on earth so let us have active faith this is an uphill battle the violent take it by force amen so i remember the sleepless night working on god's scripts with the warehouse job hmm. dealing with my evil housemates and evil landlord hmm. pushing the gospel like daily you know like god still gave me the grace the strength to write this movie script with his help and provided helpers like we met like weekly to see how the script was going you know like seriously it's not by my power it's not by my might it's by god's spirit like who would think god can turn my life into a movie hmm. god can turn my book into a movie hmm. it's a miracle so hmm, we continue in the next video <laughs> actually let's keep going so what about you get closer to god so he can write books through you produce movies through you for his glory it's all about his glory he saved my life he rescued me now he's making me share with the world you know share to the world through books and movies glory to god amen praise god